Life is Strange Season 2 Speculations Spoilers for Captain Spirit I should start this out by saying what I know. I know Chris unveils some kind of power at the end of Captain Spirit where he can float. I know there are two other characters who I think are going to be in the main season that showed up at the end of the free Captain Spirit episode. But here is what my gut feeling says. And you don't have to agree with me. I have no evidence to back up my thinking. I have two possible ideas. Chris died at the end of Captain Spirit. Knowing how Don't Nod works with their sad mechanics, I think that might be a strong possibility. Or the neighbor kid was the one with the actual powers who was saving Chris. That scene where he is magically saved, maybe that's just how he interpreted it. If Chris is dead, then he's literally going to be a Captain Spirit. I think that is the foreshadowing in his superhero name. You know, like a spirit who goes around saving people with Arcadia Bay powers? Giving credit to my idea that people who die tragic deaths in Arcadia Bay become a part of its spiritual power. The game will center around Chris helping his neighbor. Since the neighbor kid witnessed his death, that moment bonded them together. Kinda like in the book The Bone Doll's Twin or the game Beyond Two Souls, the game will center around the neighbor kid and Chris as the two main protagonists. Possibly them working together to solve problems by switching between each other. I hope this is true because the neighbor kid seems to be in my opinion, of Native American descent, and that would be a step forward for the Life is Strange series. I say this because Life is Strange uses a lot of Native American ideas and iconography, so it would be cool if they included more Native American characters. Chris will also see the grief of his father blaming himself for Chris's death. However, I worry this is too fantastical and would alienate that core relatability Life is Strange usually has. It could also be that Chris is alive, and the main character will be the neighbor with powers of their own that they used to save Chris. Chris is taken away from his father soon after and they don't meet again for a few years. But Chris remembers that day when he meets the neighbor kid again. Either way, I don't think Chris is going to be the main character. I don't have any evidence for that, I just feel that way. Again, I'm basing all this on nothing. I'm just guessing. I hope you all have a great time playing Captain Spirit and remember to play it more than once because different things happen at different times and it's almost impossible to get all the events to happen in one playthrough.